hey guys so welcome back to another amazing video if you are new thank you so much for clicking on this video it's a girl shook so Sabira, and we are back again with another banker so i will be telling you guys um should i list the amount of content no i'm just going to be telling guys of my hair i don't know you know these videos are just way off my hair like they are factual information so i don't have to go and be researching so much so much like that no i'm just going to be telling you guys my observation and things that i know and have seen okay so in this video it's all about these counties that are now booming within liberia i don't know for some reason it's not booming like it's not booming like this like this it's not booming like it's just it's there they are there but they are just cool like very cool that's a sad reality if some of you guys are from there i'm so sorry but i have to bring it to your attention because maybe most of my viewers that are watching they are not from like bureau they are from like bureau but they are not living here so maybe if i bring it to your attention you'll be like ah what is happening to my county what is happening to my area so that's what that that's the purpose of this video okay that's the purpose guys so I will be telling you guys few counties in like bureau that are not booming. Yes, it's not booming. It's not really booming. When I talk about booming, I mean like even to get transportation to go there, it takes you a while. It takes you a while, guys. Like even if you want to go there, like the way I'm sitting, here, if I want to go, be cannot now. I can just get there and go. Um. Here there be a junction. I will see. Be cano, be cano, be cano, be cano, be cano, be cano, be cano car. And then I just get on be cano car. And then I'm in be cano. And then if I want to come back like now, like the way it's after. Um, let me see what time it is. What what is the time that I'm doing this video? It's after four. So like if I want to go be cano like now, now, now. I just say be cano, be cano, and then I go. And then if I want to come back, I say be cano, be cano at the parking station, and then I will come back on the river. This content that I'm going to be listing, guys, you cannot do it. You cannot just get out like now and then you say you want to go like now and then come back. No. So the number one county on this list is Bapolu County. Bapolu County is a very beautiful county. Very beautiful, guys. It's very beautiful. We have a lot of resources there. Um, you know, all over Liberia is rich. Calling this county near doesn't mean that the area is not rich. Liberia is a rich and blessed country. No county in Liberia was left out. God blessed every county in Liberia with something. You go Babolo, you see the trees over there, you'd be like, wow. But going Babolo, you have to either go there a day before and then wait for the car to get full or you have to go Tottenham break and then we go Tottenham break you get on motorbike to go there the road is not accessible now like that that's why the people told me last time I checked which, which was two months back that's what they told me so they have the beautiful hospital there in Papolu County that the government built which is commendable but the road going there and for cars to just go there like that and the sad thing is that those the car that are flown at Douala because if you want to go Bapolo you have to go to Douala sir. Douala the driver um, they are so deceiving you have to listen to this well they will tell you yes we are going bring your money if you give them your money start to say they have to wait for low they must carry low before they pick up and not just low I mean goose for people because business people just buy their goods and then leave it with the drivers. They get on the car the way I told you how they go. And then they run motor back and then go. And then with their goods leave behind, the drivers struggle like a week to bring that goods. And when I went there, you know, I always have this angel that is ahead of me. One is on my right, one is on my left, and one is at my back. The other angel that was on my right, on my left, they were like just holding my hands from giving my transportation and then i think it's like one thousand four one thousand two to go there it's so expensive looking at the distance it's not far but that's okay i was i wanted to give the money but they were like it was my 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 angel my invisible angels they were just holding me holding 
and then my other injury at the front the injury that i have that is guarding me at the front just um by the grace of god somebody just came to me something just told me the way i asked somebody and then when i asked the guy the person told me don't you dare give the money to those people you won't go you will spend one week plus on that road i'm like wow so babalu county is one of the counties that is not boomy yes yes go and watch some videos on youtube you will see it yourself another county that i'm going to be telling you guys that is not boomy this one is a tough one hmm. so guys after giving this a hard thought i'm going to put mary lane second on the list so Maryland is a beautiful county, very beautiful with beaches, ocean, bear. They have everything there beside the coast, but sad to say it's not booming, guys. It's not booming. Maryland is not booming. Um, the reason Maryland is not booming because when it comes to inland, to assess the area inland, like going by road to that place, guys, it is very difficult. You cannot access the area so again it it all comes down to our rule right so it comes down to rule because if you want to go mary lane now a lot of time people lost their life sad to say because i have been um usually i listen to radios in few years back um because people want to go over there people have their businesses so what people do is that they get on the kino guys oh my god hmm. they get on this kino it's not even a boat sometimes the fountain people get the speed boat and they get on it going over the ocean you know what it means you know what it means guys the wave you don't have gps you don't have um how do they call the other one What's the name? I forget the name. All of those things that the people use to sell, like inform them about the, 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 the amount of wind that is coming, the storm and everything. And then you just get on the ocean. You say you want to go. You have resulted in people losing their life. These kino cap sites on the ocean what will you do you cannot swim you have your goose and they full of these things with goose to cross just to go and make um their market so maryland is a beautiful county for the roof and even it's not only maryland alone but all those counties in the southeastern region they have to be um they are not booming as they should be booming because if they if there is a road access their good road access trust me this county will be like the hottest zone in liberia because even me i would love to have my home over there those places that i'm just telling you about these places they are very beautiful maryland grand crew grand cape Mon. no not grand cape Mon. grand cape monster is a beautiful county very beautiful county the road going to grand cape Mon county is good but it's, it's it's not as good as good but at least it's something that you can manage with even though because i've been there your body will hurt shake 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 the thing about grand cape Mon county um they they are they, they are they also have um a lot of ocean water like the the beaches they have a lot of sea around them they are surrounded by by the ocean we call them the bahamas of liberia which is so beautiful and they are into fish and fishing yes so a lot of people go there to get fish from there but trust me the road going over there is so bad it's not as open because that place should be like a tourist attraction within like bro because it is it is if you look at the the lake piso it is so beautiful in grand cape Mon county but sad to say it's not booming like the way it should and the people there guys um they come to monrovia they come to Douala. with all the land they have they leave the area and then they come here to buy food 
yeah, a lot of things like in Grand Cape Mountain, yeah, they come because they were there, they love cassava. So they, 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 they usually feel like the Gary, even if you are going to their area, you will see them selling the Gary along the road in plastic there. But most of the things that they want, they come um, to a lot to get it. Yeah. So the road were in there too because that road you use it to go to the cerulean polo if you want to go there. It's not really good. It is it is horrible, guys. It is horrible. So these counters they are not booming as they should. They are not booming. I'm doing I I'm being very careful here with this information that I'm giving, guys. They are, so I'm trying to think about my choice of words and everything. Even though I want to be as blonde and as fair and as open as a book telling you guys why these counties are not booming. That's why I'm trying to take my time to explain it. So these counties, they are not booming as they should be booming. Like, you know, yeah. So, but they are, they are all beautiful areas. They have potential. You can go there if you have like a big chalk um, four wheel, but it should not be that way, right? It should be all in a way where everybody can uh, can have access to the area. Just how at the beginning of the video, I I talk about um, Bicano or Nima County. Like if I'm sitting here, if I want to go Nima County, if I want to go Bond County, I can just pick up my bag and then just go. Yeah. So we pray that um, this county should come out. And then be able to stay on their own because trust me, these counties that are just listed, they are so beautiful, they are rich in biodiversity, they are rich in everything. But the problem is road access all comes down to road access. And the citizens of these counties need to try and go back home to be able to fix their area because people from Basel cannot go Maryland to go and face Maryland. People from Mirele cannot go Papolu to go and face Papolu. They are only go there to like invest, get what they want to get from there, then go and invest in that area, face that area. That's the real truth. So if you are from that area, you are the one who have to advocate for your place. I'm talking about it now, but you should be the one to talk about it and then work in line with higher authorities so that they can fix these rules. To open your county because your county trust me is so beautiful but uh, you guys just have like a few challenges that's all so i pray and hope that after me a year of you, of this video being out we will see a difference guys because i really want to visit this area but due to the rural issue the southeastern part of liberia have been cut out of the whole booming life that is happening other side guys that's the sad reality. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love hearing from you all as usual. I want to know your take on this. Subscribe to the channel and let us keep growing, guys. Bye.